Yo, 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 it's David down at Crosstown Chrysler in Edmonton, Alberta. And from the used car superstore is this 2016 Ram 1500 SLT in bright white, powered by the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine underneath the hood. This is a quad cab configuration truck with the six foot box on the back. Come to the front here, you'll have halogen headlamps lighting up the road in front of you with high beams which are also the running lights and turn signals of course you have a honeycomb inside the grill with chrome surrounding it adding to the unique ram looks that everybody loves and there's two tow hooks on the front bumper front and rear bumpers are chrome and there is a chrome bug deflector on the front of the hood too come to the side here this ram 1500 slt is running on 17 inch Goodyear Wrangler mud and snow tires with plenty of tread on there you'll surely have lots of traction they're on alloy rims and there's mud flaps behind all four tires four-wheel disc brakes all around and on both sides of this truck there are chrome running boards which makes it that much easier to get inside chrome door handles on the outside on all four doors and both driver and passenger side door mirrors have built-in LED turns to the lamps these are breakaway, and these are heated mirrors as well. So heat these up, defrost them, and see what's beside you. There's also LED clearance lights built in to the bottom of the mirrors, which you'll surely see at nighttime. This also has chrome vent visors. Open up the driver's side door here. Two-tone interior colors. Storage down below with two cup holders, storage in the middle. Nice place for an arm, this has Power mirrors, power windows, power locks with window lock. Driver and passenger side windows up front are automatic. This has power folding in mirrors. Press this button here, the mirrors fold in. Press it again, and they come right back out. Fantastic feature to have in case you're trying to park in a tight parking spot. Chrome door handles on the inside on all four doors, and beautiful styling. Directional air vent right here, which you can easily adjust, and you can close and open that. This has automatic headlamps, so you can set it and forget it. Dimmer knob there, that button there will turn on the box lights. Handle here so you, the driver, can easily get inside this truck. This has a leather wrapped steering wheel, feels great in your hands. Is a tilt steering wheel too. Driver's seat is fully powered with lumbar support. This has cloth seating throughout, adjustable headrests on the front seats, and this has adjustable seatbelt height. So depending on how big or tall of a person you are, you can adjust the seatbelt heights you're most comfortable inside this Ram 1500. And there's a pocket on the side of the middle console right there. Nice big Ram badge right here, nice materials. So arms can rest on here. Grab this chrome handle. There's an upper storage area here and there's a change holder. And not to worry, there's a USB port, an easily port, an SD card port connect to your media, along with another USB port. And if you have cords coming out of here, Run them along the side so when you close the lid, it doesn't crush your cords. Grab a lower. There's an even larger storage area. It has a little ledge there for some pens. And there's two big cup holders in the middle here with bubbles to hold your cups in place. And this has an auto dimming rear view mirror. Let's go check out the back seat area. All right, so there is a power window switch right there. Nice place for an arm, chrome handle, convenience handle here. So your passengers can easily lift themselves into the back seat area. There is tons of foot room along with plenty of headroom. Hooks up above so you can nice clothing. So if you're going to a nice event, your clothing doesn't get all wrinkled. Adjustable headrest in the back seats too. The seats do flip up like so. As a fold out gate here, you can put things underneath or on top for storage. If you're not using it, you can easily fold it back. And underneath here, there's even more storage space. And there's a clip right here, so you can clip this up and secure it. There's two big cup holders down here. There's a 12 volt DC power outlet and a nice ramp badge. And the interior lamp up here, push it with your handle, come on. Push it again, it will shut off. This is where we put gasoline inside this ram. And this does have ram boxes built into the box. They're very handy to have for storage and they unlock and lock just by using the key fob. So 
when you hit the unlock button, all the doors will unlock, and so will the brand boxes. The lock button, the doors will lock, and so will the RAM boxes along with the tailgate. But to open it up, it's very easy. Just press this here, easily open this up. Lots of space in here for many different things, and there are convenience lights. And you easily close them back up, just like this. And there's a spot for a trailer hitch down below here with connections so you can hook up a trailer or power up any aftermarket devices using this RAM 1500. Nice badging, SLT, RAM badge, 4x4 badge, back of camera is built into the tailgate handle here. Open up the tailgate. This does have spray and bed liner. There's hooks in all four corners so you can tie on your load so you don't lose your load when you're driving down the highway. And there's LED box lights here. And of course, regular box lights just up there. And as I mentioned, this is a locking tailgate. Here's the ramp box on the other side here. Power window switch, nice place for an arm, looking good. Convenience handle right here. Pocket on the back of the passenger seat. And of course there's a pocket on the back of the driver's seat too. This side also folds up like this. And there's a fold out gate here. Again, put things on top or underneath for storage. And there's two cutouts for the cup holders in the middle, which I think is a very clever touch. This easily folds back like this. And underneath here, there's even more storage space. Storage down below with two cup holders, storage in the middle, power locks, power window switch, great style, looking good. Spot for some pens or packs of gum right here. Directional air vent which you can close and open. Handle right here so your front passenger can easily lift themselves inside this truck. Passenger seat is manual adjustment. Underneath the passenger seat are the tire chute tools which allows for easy access. And there's airbags built into the front seats, the side curtain airbags, driver and passenger side airbags and more. Let's hop inside and take a closer look right now. So this is the key fob. There's an unlock button, a lock button, and a panic button. And this does have remote start using this button right here. All you gotta do is press this button twice. The doors will lock and then the truck will start right up. Boom, just like that. And there's a nice RAM badge on the back. Then you can just hit the unlock button like this, pop inside the RAM here, push the key fob into the ignition like so. All you gotta do is turn it and I'll get you past the remote start system. There is an LCD driver information center. It is absolutely fantastic and gives you tons of information. And this truck only has 86,501 kilometers on it. Not too bad, so definitely come book a test drive soon and using buttons on the left side of the steering wheel right here, we can go through the driver information center. And the first thing you'll see is that there's a digital speedometer, which you can change to miles per hour if you're going to the States. You have your vehicle info, tells you tire pressure for all four tires, tells you your transmission temperature, oil temperature, oil life, full on gauge summary, engine hours, fuel economy area, lets you know your average liters per 100 kilometers, your current liters per 100 kilometers, and your fuel range on your tank of fuel. Hold this button right here, and you can easily reset your average liters per 100 kilometers. You have a trip A calculator and a trip B calculator. The trip B calculator has never been reset before, so you can be the first one to reset that. Both of them tell you how far you've driven, your average fuel economy, your average vehicle speed, and the time in driving for. Hold this button right here, and you can easily reset that. And there's an audio center that lets you know it's playing on your media. Message center in case the RAM wants to tell you something. Screen set up here, so you can customize the screen, make it more of your own. There's a compass outside thermometer some blank spaces go in the screen setup here and you customize what's on the screen and back to the digital speedometer and if you open up any door on this truck i'll let you know which door on the truck is opened and there's a nice big ram badge in the middle here with of course a horn is very loud horn cruise control on the right with your gear selection buttons right there and behind the steering wheel there's steering wheel mounted audio controls that allows you to adjust your volume Go through your presets and so much more. Push button four wheel drive down below. Handy to have in the winter time. Rotary style gear shifter, throw this truck into reverse. The backup camera appears on the touch screen system, giving you a great view of what's behind you. And if I turn the wheel, it'll guide you to where you're going to be backing up. 
excellent. Large storage area down here. There's a cell phone holder, a 12 volt DC power outlet, and even more storage space right here. This does have heated seats up front, and there's two settings for both. This also has a heated steering wheel, traction control, tow slash haul mode, 115 volt AC power outlet. Another great spot for some pens or packs of gum. Directional air vents here, which you can easily adjust and you can close and open these. Nice RAM badge, a little spot for some things. Programmable garage door opener up here. Switch here for the rear sliding window so you can open and close that. And of course there's reading lamps, which are also the interior lighting. Fold down sun visors with convenience mirrors, with convenience lights so you and your passenger can look at yourselves whenever you want. And there's tons of visibility out the front window. This does have voice recognition. Cancel. Cancel. Using voice recognition, you can tune into a specific radio station just by using your voice. And this button here will allow you to answer calls that come through Bluetooth. And here's a touchscreen Uconnect system. It says AM, FM, radio, and Sirius XM. It tells you a song, the artist in the middle of the screen. You can tune into a specific radio station that you want to listen to. Access to a mini map connected to GPS navigation right here. Easily adjust your audio, balance fade, equalizer, speed adjusted volume, auxiliary volume offset, presets up above. Easily hold one of the boxes with your finger and you can easily set a preset. Info bar up top tells you the outside temperature. There's a compass, the time, and what the temperature is set at. And if I turn the volume here, sounds really good. Definitely rock out, have a good time inside this Ram 1500 SLT. And you can turn it back down just like this. This is the volume knob and there's also a mute button there. This is a tuning knob and a browse button. Back button here to help you guide to your system. Hazards, turn the screen off if you don't look at it. Touch your finger, it comes back on. And these are the physical climate controls. So you can make the temperature warmer or colder, turn on the air conditioning, make it max AC front defrost and this button here will turn on the heat mirrors adjust your fan speed and you can turn it off right there too media button here so usb auxiliary if there's anything plugged in those areas a bluetooth device connected or something in the sd card port go to the media area here and you can listen to music through those areas and there's also access to a mini map right there too controls here so you can turn on and off the heated seats and the heated steering wheel just by using the touch screen here or you can do it down below and you can access the back of camera without this truck being in reverse and you also have a mirror dimmer there too and settings you connect area shows you all the cool stuff that you have touch screen climate controls adjust where you want the air to go adjust your fan speed adjust the temperature turn on rear window defroster it's great to use large map here for gps navigation you can zoom in and you can zoom out on the map put in the address i'll show you how to get to where you want to go you search up points of interest and more gps navigation is great to have bluetooth area here pair of phone make hands-free calls you can pair more than one device hands-free calls is a safe way to do things and you can access your phone book view recent calls and so much more all right, it's the 2016 Ram 1500 SLT in bright white, powered by the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine underneath the hood. It has chrome running boards. It has Ram boxes, spray and bed liner, cloth seating, back of camera, remote start, and so much more. Come on down to Crosstown Chrysler and see if this is gonna be your next everyday driver. I'm Matt David, and I'll talk to you later. Yeah, yeah.